Hey, what's up everyone? And welcome back to AI in Action. You've probably spent countless hours using AI chatbots like ChatGPT, but what if I told you there's a tool that combines the conversational power of a large language model with the factual accuracy of a real-time search engine? That tool is Perplexity AI. And honestly, it's become one of my most used tools for everything from scripting these videos to deep diving into new tech. People often call it ChatGPT with sources, but that's just scratching the surface. So I spent dozens of hours breaking down every single feature for you. In this video, I'm giving you the complete masterclass. We'll cover its powerful search capabilities, how to use it for deep research, generating entire web pages, automating your daily news intake, and even a look at its AI-powered web browser, Comet. My goal is simple. By the end of this video, you'll be a Perplexity Power user, ready to save hours of work. Ready to level up your research game? Let's get straight into it. Perplexity Features and Interface Overview All right, so first things first, what exactly is Perplexity? Perplexity calls itself the world's first answer engine. Instead of just giving you a list of blue links like Google, it reads them, understands them, and then gives you a direct summarized answer with all the sources cited. It's built for accuracy and efficiency. When you first land on perplexity.ai, the interface is clean and familiar. Right in the center, you have the main prompt window where you'll ask your questions. But the magic is in the details. Just below the prompt while you're typing it in, you have the focus filter. This is huge. The search icon is for fast answers to your questions, followed by the deep research. Then you have labs that allows you to create a project you have in mind from scratch. Then you have the internet icon. When you click on it, it gives a variety of sources you can use for your research, from the web, academic papers, social, which gives access to social media. Beside it is the icon to choose a model. And Perplexity is like an all-in-one tool that gives you access to various models, from ChatGPT, Claude to Grok. Next to that, you have the icon that allows you upload files while using the tool. Then theirs is dictation, meaning you can talk to the AI using your voice. And once you're done, just click enter. To the left, you have the plus icon to start a thread. Thread is like the chat. Unlike ChatGPT, Claude that uses chat, Perplexity uses thread instead. On the top left, you have the home tab, which is this main screen. When you hover over it, it shows you finance, travel, academic, then sports. After that, you, you're your library. Library is where you have your previous projects. When you click on finance, it takes you a new pages that has all the latest news on finance. Just below, you can type in any prompt to ask questions. Same thing with the other pages for travel. You can type in any question related to traveling or location. Go to sport, you have the latest news about sport and you can ask any question you want. Next is the Discover tab. This is a personalized feed of trending topics and news, which is fantastic for staying up to date. We have the For You page, top tech and science, finance, arts and culture, sports, entertainment pages. The For You page shows you personalized news for you. The top page shows you trending topics, while the remaining pages are based on what their name sounds like. Tech and science is focused on just that, etc. The Spaces tab. Space is like projects in Claude and ChatGPT. Space is a workspace feature that allows you to create dedicated environments with custom knowledge, instructions, and context that persists across multiple conversations. Finally, you have the install icon. If you click on it, it shows you the various format you can access the Perplexity tool with Comet Browser that was recently introduced, the Perplexity for mobile, Perplexity for desktop, on the Pro plan, you also get access to different AI models. You can let Perplexity choose the best one automatically, or you can manually select powerful models like GPT-4.0, Claude 3 Opus, or Perplexity's own advanced models. This flexibility is incredible because you get access to the best models on the market under one subscription. Now that we've got the lay of the land, let's dive into its most powerful feature, Intelligent Search. Feature one intelligent search and the focus filter. This is where perplexity shines. Let's run a practical example. Imagine I'm starting a new channel focused on financial education for young adults. My first question might be, what are the biggest financial challenges for Gen Z in 2025? Now, watch what happens. Perplexity doesn't just give me an answer. 
First, you can see it's actively searching the web, listing out the sources it's checking in real time. Then it compiles all of that information into a clear, concise summary. It lists challenges like high personal debt, particularly student loan debt, rising living costs. And here's the best part. At the end of each paragraph, there's a short text in smaller font. That's the citations. Hover over any citations, you will see the list of sources. Clicking on a source takes you directly to the source article so you can verify the information yourself. This is the trust factor that's often missing in other AIs. But let's refine this. Maybe I want to understand the discussion around this topic. If I wanted academic data, I'd switch the focus to academic to pull from research papers and studies. This ability to instantly switch context makes your research faster and far more targeted. But I will suggest you choose the academic paper as part of your sources before clicking enter, because as of today, you can't switch between source, whatever source you start you thread with, that's the source you end with, or you create a new thread to use a new source. Feature two, deep research with pro search. The standard search is great for quick questions, but what if you need a comprehensive report on a topic? That's where pro search comes in. This is a feature for paid users and it's basically an autonomous research agent. Let's stick with our finance channel example. I'll ask it a much more complex question. Create a detailed research report on the effectiveness of TikTok versus YouTube Shorts for promoting financial literacy content to audiences under 25. When you run a pro search, perplexity takes a moment to understand your query and will ask you clarifying questions to make sure it delivers exactly what you need. I'll tell it to focus on engagement metrics, user trust, and content format. Now it goes to work. This process takes a few minutes because it's not just searching, it's analyzing dozens of sources, identifying key themes, and structuring it all into a formal report. While it's working, you can go do something else, and Perplexity will notify you when it's done. And here we go. We have a full-blown report. It has main takeaway, audience analysis section, engagement quality section, and a conclusion with recommendations. And of course, every single point is meticulously cited with dozens of sources. Creating something like this manually would take hours, if not days. This is a total game changer for content creators, marketers, and students. Okay, quick pause. We've just covered the core search features that make Perplexity so powerful. I'm curious to know how you would use this. What's one complex research question you'd love to ask Perplexity's Pro Search? Drop your ideas in the comments below. I'll read through them, and it might just inspire a future video. Now, let's get back to organizing all this amazing research. Feature 3. Perplexity Labs tackles complex projects on your behalf by crafting complete deliverables, including reports, spreadsheets, interactive dashboards, and simple web applications all backed by extensive research and analysis. Unlike regular perplexity search that provides answers to specific questions, Labs goes several steps further by creating complete projects with multiple components. It has access to advanced tools including deep web browsing, code execution, chart creation, and image generation to assemble content that would previously take days to complete. So let's give it a try. Choose the Labs option by clicking on the icon next to Deep Research, Paste your prompt, click enter, let's what it does. So what this prompt asks for is to analyze my channel. Look at this. It starts by saying the AI in action channel, dedicated to real world applications and insights into artificial intelligence is a promising venture within the fast-growing AI content niche. To maximize your impact and ensure sustained growth, this report assesses your present strategies, identifies weaknesses, and delivers concrete recommendations formed from industry benchmarks, best practices, and current policy updates. The entire report has been divided into sections. Feature four, the Discover tab, your AI newsfeed. All right, let's talk about staying current. The Discover tab is your personalized, AI-curated newsfeed. It learns from your search history and interests to show you what's new and important in your field. For me, my feed is packed with the latest developments in AI, machine learning, and tech startups. For you, it might be finance, 
marketing, or whatever you're passionate about. What makes this different from other news aggregators is the presentation. It doesn't just show you a headline. It gives you a quick, AI-generated summary of the story with links to the key sources. You can get the gist of a major development in 30 seconds instead of reading five different articles. I start my day here every morning to catch up on what's new in the world of AI. It's an incredible tool for continuous learning. Feature 5. Comet, the AI native browser. Now for something a bit more advanced. Comet. This is Perplexity's standalone web browser, and it's their vision for the future of browsing, one where an AI assistant is always there to help. Comet lets you interact with any web page using AI. You can access it by going to the install icon I showed you previously, download it, Let's say you're on a long, complex article about quantum computing. You can click on Assistant to open the Comet sidebar and ask, Summarize this article for a beginner. Or, explain the concept of quantum superposition in a simple analogy. It can even summarize entire YouTube videos without you having to watch the whole thing. Now, a quick note on this. Comet can also do things like find discount codes or fill out forms. Personally, I'm still a bit cautious about giving any AI tool access to sensitive information like passwords or credit cards. The technology is still evolving. However, for research and content consumption, it's incredibly powerful. My favorite use case is opening a long YouTube tutorial and asking Comet, find the exact timestamp where the creator explains how to set up the database. It saves me from scrubbing through the video trying to find that one specific part. All right, we're covering a ton of ground here, and I hope you're finding this walkthrough valuable. If you're enjoying this deep dive into AI tools, do me a huge favor and hit that like button. It really helps the channel out. And if you want to see more tutorials like this one, make sure you're subscribed to AI in Action with notifications on. Feature six, automation with the Perplexity API. For the power users and developers watching, this one's for you. Perplexity also has an API, which allows you to integrate its answer engine into your own applications and workflows. The possibilities here are endless. You could build a customer service bot for your website that answers questions based on your product documentation. You could create an automated workflow that scours the web for mentions of your brand every day and sends you a summarized report. I personally use it with automation tools like Zapier. For example, I have a workflow that watches for new AI research papers on a specific topic. When a new one is published, it automatically sends the paper to the Perplexity API, gets a summary, and drops that summary into my Notion database. It's like having a personal research assistant working for me 24-7. While this is more advanced, it shows that Perplexity isn't just a tool, it's a platform. Pricing, and is it worth it? Okay, let's talk about the big question. What does all of this cost? Perplexity has a very generous free tier. You get a limited number of pro searches per day, but you can do plenty of standard searches. This is more than enough to get a feel for the platform and use it for everyday questions. The pro plan is $20 per month and is what I personally use. This unlocks everything we've talked about. Over 300 pro searches per day. The ability to upload files for analysis access to the latest and most powerful AI models like GPT-40 and Claude-3 Opus, access to the API and the Comet browser. For me, the time saved and the quality of the research make the Pro Plan a no-brainer. If you are a student, a researcher, a marketer, or a content creator, the return on investment is massive. You get access to multiple top-tier AI models and a world-class search tool for the price of one subscription. All right, we've covered everything from basic searches and deep research reports to AI-powered browsers and automation. You are now officially equipped to use Perplexity like a pro.
To make sure you've got it all down, here's a final challenge for you. Think about a daily or weekly task you do that involves research or staying up to date. In the comments, describe how you could use a perplexity feature like ProSearch, the Discover tab, or even the API to automate or improve that task. Perplexity is more than just a search engine. It's a tool for understanding. It helps you cut through the noise of the internet to find clear, accurate, and trustworthy answers. Thank you so much for joining me today on AI in Action. I hope this masterclass was helpful. If it was, let me know by leaving a like and a comment. Now go give perplexity a try and supercharge your workflow. I'll see you in the next video.